uploaded a video for like the past three weeks. That's really, really long for me because I usually upload weekly. I'm definitely gonna be working on uploading videos a lot more frequently, but I am super, like, I always say super excited, but I'm super excited today um, because I'm getting a fish that I've been wanting for like the longest time. I've always want, I don't even know if it's a fish. I really don't know. But I am getting an eel. I've always wanted one of these guys and um, I've had no legit reason as to why I want an eel. I just want one because they're really cool and they're like wiggle. And they remind me of a snake a little bit and my wife won't let me have a snake and so that's the next best thing. And they like aquariums so why not? But anyways, I just got a phone call from the local fish store that the eel that I specially ordered for today is waiting for his weird new owner. That would be neat. Let's rock and roll, dude. <laughs> Think about this fish, Jaden. It's gotta be so so cool when he has it. <laughs> you got your shirt on backwards. So we are home and ready to get this baby in the water. So while we're waiting on that, I've got a little piece of live rock right here that I'm gonna put in the tank. I'm definitely planning on getting more live rock soon, but this will do just for starters, considering on the size of this thing. Super small, I mean, he's not small, small, but he's pretty small. He's gonna have to tank to himself for a little, little bit until he gets up, gets up to about a decent size, so. I think this little piece of rock will be good for him right now, so we're going to go ahead and put this thing in here. Alright guys, so while we wait on the acclimation, I'm pretty sure these guys are hungry. I mean, it's like 3 in the morning, but... Why not knock it out now, I guess? I'm pretty sure these guys won't attest to it and neither will Mudkip because he needs to eat too. So we're gonna go ahead and feed these guys really quick. Who's gonna cut up? There he is. Roscoe always comes up first, I swear. This guy's still hiding in the hole. <laughs> uh, now you wanna come out. Oh man, he took the big piece. He took the big piece. So my sibling game is way too weak right now. We're about to go over here and um, see what's up with Mudkip though. Here's Mr. Mudkip just chilling right here. I gotta start scraping his glass up. I got a little bit of algae and stuff all up right here. Eat you some warm, bro, bro. Ooh, Dude, it's like a scary movie. Look behind you. Look behind you, what are you doing? All right, so this guy's acclimation is now over, so let's get him in the water. So here's a close up of the snowflake eel right here. It's an Indo-Pacific fish, so that kind of adds to its exoticness. If you look at it, like just the patterns on this guy are beautiful, it's amazing, but I'm pretty sure he's ready to get into this tank. He really wants to come out of that bag. So,
that's one of the most newest additions to the family guys I don't have a name for him at the moment so if you guys got any suggestions please leave them in the comments below but anyways it's just so crazy how like accustomed he grown to the tank as soon as I put him in there it wasn't even like a whole 24 hours of him being in the tank and he was already trying to eat from my hand but I got a little nervous because he was snapping really quick so I went ahead and used the tweezers and fed him that way but anyways guys that's my snowflake eel it's not every day that you go to someone's house and see an eel so I'm really really happy that I got a different pet like that but anyways if you like my content please like comment and subscribe this is the fish keeper thanks for watching